In this video, we're going to show you how easy it is to enter scores into your tournament. Let's start by clicking on the Scores tab in the menu. Once here, you'll see the number of golfers that are in your tournament, how many scores you've entered, and how many scores have been verified. Let's enter score. By default, this screen will show all golfers that have not entered their scores. We highly recommend that you allow golfers to use our mobile app to enter scores. This will save you lots of time. To begin, you can use the search feature to find golfers' names, you can select their tee-off time from the drop-down, you can look for golfers that have already entered their scores, you just simply select what options and click Update View. The easiest way to get started is just click on the golfer's name and the scorecard will be displayed. Depending on what scoring options you picked in your tournament options, you could either enter all 18 holes or just the front and back 9. For this tournament, we selected to enter all 18 holes. The system will automatically put your cursor at hole 1 so you can begin entering your scores. Using your number keys, you start entering the scores for the golfer. As you enter a score, you'll automatically be tabbed to the next hole, and once you've completed entering all 18 holes, you'll get tabbed down to the Save and Next button. You can either click on this or just simply hit your Enter or Spacebar. As you can see as you're entering each score, the par status for every hole, along with the front, back line, and total scores, are being calculated for you automatically. Once you've done a scorecard, you'll automatically be forward to the next golfer. Depending on your speed, it takes anywhere between 5 to 7 seconds to fully enter a scorecard for a golfer. Let's go back to the main screen. You can see the scorecard is very colorful. The clear represents that it's par, the red represents that it's over par, and the green represents that it's under par. You can also see the par status for the golfer's round. Easy Golf Tour also gives you the ability to export scores to Excel. Simply hit the export button and open up the CSV file in Excel. You can see that all scoring information, including the tee-off time, the golfer's name, and all the hole details are there for you. Let's go back to the main screen. So now we're going to enter some more scores. So for the 808 time, we have four golfers that we have not entered scores for, and we also have four golfers in the 816 time that we have not entered scores for. So let's go back and see what happens. Again, we're going to add scores for the four golfers. So we just did the first golf in the group, and now we're doing the second, third, and then the fourth golfer. Watch when we do the fourth golfer. It'll automatically go from the 808 time to the 816 time to make it easier and faster for you to enter your scores.